Ah, your eyes finally open. Mother shall be pleased. I am Morrigan, lest you have forgotten, and we are in the wilds where I am bandaging your wounds. You are welcome, by the way. How does your memory fare? Do you remember Mother's rescue? Mother managed to save you and your friend, though t'was a close call. What is important is that you both live. The man who was to respond to your signal quit the field. The Darkspawn won your battle. Those he abandoned were massacred. Your friend, he is not taking it well. As you like. Mother is outside with your friend. She wished to see you when you awoke. Yes, but I expect you shall be fine. The Darkspawn did nothing Mother could not heal. I... You were welcome. Though Mother did most of the work, I am no healer. I do not mind. Take your time. Only stragglers that are long gone. You would not want to see what is happening in that valley now. Are you sure you want me to describe it? I had a good view of the battlefield. Tis a grisly scene. There are bodies everywhere, and Darkspawn swarm them, feeding, I think. They also look for survivors and drag them back down beneath the ground. I cannot say why. I do not know who this Loghain even is. Perhaps ask Mother of it. I wonder at that myself, but she tells me nothing. Perhaps you were the only ones she could reach. I would have rescued your king. A king would be worth a much higher ransom than you. What a sensible attitude. Mother is seldom sensible, however. She turned into a giant bird and plucked the two of you from atop the tower, one in each talon. If you do not believe that tale, then I suggest you ask Mother yourself. She may even tell you. We are safe for the moment. Mother's magic keeps the Darkspawn away. Once you leave, tis uncertain what will happen. The Horde has moved on, so you might avoid it. I agree. Tis time you speak with Mother, then be on your way. See, here is your fellow Grey Warden. You worry too much, young man. You... you're alive. <laughs> I thought you were dead for sure. Oh, this doesn't seem real. If it weren't for Morrigan's mother, we'd be dead on top of that tower. Do not talk about me as if I am not present, lad. I, I didn't mean... But, but what do we call you? You've, ne you've never told us your name? Names are pretty, but useless. The chastened folk call me Flemeth. I suppose it will do. The Flemeth? From the legends? Daveth was right. You're the Witch of the Wilds, aren't you? And what does that mean? I know a bit of magic, and it has served you both well, has it not? If you know what is good for you, I suppose you should. <laughs> All that I wish you to do is what you are meant to do. It has always been the Grey Warden's duty to unite the lands against the Blight. Or did that change when I wasn't looking? That doesn't make any sense. Why would he do it? Now that is a good question. Men's hearts hold shadows darker than any tainted creature. Perhaps he believes the Blight is an army he can outmaneuver. Perhaps he does not see that the evil behind it is the true threat. The Archdemon. Kaelin already summoned them. They'll come if they can, but... I expect Loghain has already taken steps to stop them. 
We must assume they won't arrive in time. Me? I am just an old woman who lives in the wilds. I know nothing of blights and darkspawn. Well, whatever Loghain's insanity, he obviously thinks the darkspawn are a minor threat. We must warn everyone this isn't the case. And who will believe you? Unless you think to convince this Loghain of his mistake. 